Welcome to Trimble Business Center Aerial Photogrammetric Module, TBC APM. So in this short video here, I want to show you how you can use the course in the best way so that hopefully um, you will find um, what you need in this case. So what you will have is at the beginning a short teaser showing you how simple it is to process drone data in TBC. So really drag and drop in three steps with uh, the drone supported and you can run directly your deliverables. Then the introduction is um, helping you to see what tutorial data we use, where you can download it and also uh, that every tutorial also has a PDF which you can follow, which is great. And then the video here is just helping you to go into more detail about every of these different tutorial steps which are explained. Additionally to the PDF, there's also a workflow bulletin also explained into the introduction. So it's really worth reading the workflow bulletin. It explains all the photogrammetric steps in a technical way also how it is processed in Trimble Business Center Aero Photogrammetry. And then we really go through the different steps. So project setup, um, the relative adjustment, so how the images connect to each other. Always at the beginning, a lot of theory. Yeah? So you can jump, every video has at the bottom um, a, a, a timeline. And there are also the timeline is in this case named. Yeah? It's YouTube videos where you can jump to a different part in the video. Use it, um, don't get bored. Your goal here is that you learn more, that you understand how it works. Um, typically always at the end of the video, only then the run is done, which is very short. So um, therefore, feel free to leave the parts that where you already feel comfortable. But the goal is really in this video to learn, to understand how it works, uh, to understand uh, what are the benefits of using some parts. So, and this is really where we go into detail for every part relative adjustment, which is then the adjust photo stations, then the baseline processing, where are all the data stored? So this is always also part, where can I find in TBC all the different uh, files that are imported or what, which files do I need? How can I check if they are correct? And uh, this is everything in the video material important and also examples. So for the deliverables in the point cloud, we go through every single point cloud method that you can generate through every auto photo generation method that you can run in TBC, showing the examples, showing the benefits, showing what causes the advantages and disadvantages of each product and where you can use it in your portfolio. So I hope you enjoy this video series. This will always be extended. So this video here will probably always be exchanged trying to keep up to date and therefore have fun, enjoy it, have a nice day, goodbye.